Hey folks, I'm back with the Prius Carmen Ghia. Uh, you're looking at the A-pillar on the passenger side. On the lower A-pillar, I attached the door hinge post with this plate. Strengthens up that area. Up to this point, it just had that bolt running up through the A-pillar. And uh, a little too weak for my taste. Uh, the bond was on there just to keep the... Uh, moisture out of that crack and out of that area. Uh, here's the plate that I created for the driver's side. Um, getting ready to put the windshield in. So I painted around uh, the windshield opening. Uh, got it prepped. I just used some Rust-Oleum, rattle can, gray. Um, I am not going for pretty on this build. This is just purely form and function. Here it is with the windshield in. It only takes about a half hour to put a windshield in. You can do it by yourself. Real simple. Um, I will need to take the windshield out if I ever need to take the front end off. Uh, but only anticipate needing to take the front end off on major repairs. So here I am getting ready to take it for a test drive. Uh, get that annoying Prius backup beep. Sounds a little loud here. Uh, when I shortened the Prius, I took that 11 inches out, I cut the exhaust system off. Uh, so it just comes back so far and stops. Um, I'll get that welded back on a little later on. Uh, runs and drives great, uh, no issues there. When I get back to the shop, it'll actually, the gas engine will turn off, it'll be on electric. You hear some clanking, it's just a bracket that's bouncing against the frame. I just didn't get it bolted up yet, it's just a part of the wiring. I think it's a sensor for the airbags. Uh, so this is where we're at right now. Next thing I need to do is I would like to get that front bumper on, uh, cover that lower part of the radiator. I gotta get the rockers on it. I would also like to pull all the guts out of the Prius doors um, and then put them in the Ghia doors. So we got power windows, power door locks, uh, keyless entry, um, all that jazz. So uh, go ahead and like, subscribe. Um, I'll be doing an update again soon. And I uh, appreciate you uh, checking out the progress so far. Uh, if you have not seen this guy yet, he is building a squareback with a Mazda Miata drivetrain. Real slick. Check it out.